What's so funny? You trying to reach up and stop the ceiling fan blades. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys. Alright guys. We are... I've already opened this up. That I couldn't help but take a look at it earlier. But we have got the Arcom Digital Incubator. This thing controls your humidity levels, gives you accurate control of the humidity level and the temperature. So I am really excited about this. Um, we got the Max. Um, we didn't get the, the uh, Pro. The Pro, you really, it, it allows you to set it for um, the particular bird. Uh, the Max gives you a little bit more leeway where you can do two different types of birds. So we have got this because I had a massive failure with my call duck hatch because we were using these old outdated styrofoam incubators, which will work for chickens and stuff like that. But when you need something that really, you got to really have good control over the humidity and stuff like that, those those incubators just do not work very well plus i had a fan motor go out on mine and we just had all kind of problems with it and it really aggravated me so i went out and i bought the arcom this is supposed to be a really great incubator so we're going to give it a try and see we're going to hatch some uh turkeys and some duck eggs today so let's get her open And if you look at this one. Yeah, I'll move the box. This one allows you to set the humidity and the temperature. And uh, use a little finger thing. Mm -hmm. And what I like is, look at this lid. It's it's hollow. It's double. It uh, has two layers on it. So it helped insulate them instead of those styrofoam ones just have a little thin piece of glass in the top of them. So, and another thing I like about these is these will, you can set them to whatever size eggs you have. But before you set that up, Let's show them the latches and the inside. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know you're. Ex I know you're excited, aren't you? Yes, I am. So this is also really easy to clean. It's got a latch in the front and two latches right here in the back. In the back. So this whole top part comes off, and the little tray liner's there. So this now, comes off. You can wipe this down. This comes off. That's the. This is what moves the eggs for you back and forth. There's a little mechanism if you want to show them. See these grooves right here? They line up with that. that. So this is the egg turner. The floor itself moves. Mm -hmm. And then... That's the got, humidity. That's the humidity. You got all the electronics. This is where you pour in the water. It has a double tray. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, this thing really allows... Or, yep, let's put the... Gotta put that together. Gotta put it together, right? Nope. Nope. Yeah, <laughs> just away. All the way up, yep. Yeah. All right. Okay. And you can see how easy it slides. So, yeah, that's move. really neat. Move it to one side here. And it's so easy to put together. And then here's where you pour in the water. You pour the water in. And it has a little styrofoam float there. Mm -hmm. And it's connected. There's a tube that runs to the other reserve over here. So that way you fill up both. So what you do is you fill it up. Let the ball come up. Then you stop. Wait for five minutes for it to equalize. Mm -hmm. And then fill it back up again. Yeah. And then that's... Then the tray goes in, and then you can also, this is 
these pop out as well um, to, clean. to clean as well this is the and with this you you set your eggs to whatever side this thing will do anything from quail eggs to emu eggs mm -hmm. which i'm quite excited about because i am going to talk amy into letting me have some emu eggs sooner or later yeah well we got to get the fencing around the rest of the property because that emu is going to want to run yep so might nugget might have competition <laughs> <laughs> and then here's the power cord Oh, and then also, too, it comes with this um, plastic sticker, which is removable, that gives you the functions. So you can actually put it on the glass part. This is see-through, so you can still and see. And I haven't played with the functions yet. No. So. I'll show you guys the back. And then over here, we're setting this up in our bedroom because today we're doing a moving day. So Donald um, moved around some stuff, and we're going to have it here, so that way it's less likely it's going to get knocked over for any reason. It sings. It sings to you. Nice. Shouldn't we have water in it? Mm hmm. Yeah, probably would help. Is there an on-off button? I, uh, I do not see an on-off button. So, looks like you need the instructions. Yeah, so I'll turn it off. <laughs> okay, guys. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get this all set up. And get our eggs in there. And I'll show you how to set it. I already poured some water in here already. So, I let it equalize. Let's see the styrofoam. Yeah, the little styrofoam ball come up. So. So now we have turkey eggs and duck eggs. So yeah, we're doing these are all these here are turkeys, and then these guys here are duck eggs. I don't think all of them are gonna fit in there. No. <laughs> so well, you're gonna choose the turkey first, then. Yeah, and the idea is to give them. You want it. You don't want it like super tight. Like that would be too tight. Give them just a little bit of room. Really? Yeah. So we fit about three. Mm, I don't know. Uh, no, too, because they have to roll side to side. Yeah. We may just be doing turkey eggs. Mm hmm. Space about. No, no, no. The eggs. We got room. That way, if they do, when they do roll, it'll roll with no problems. All right. These turkey eggs are just. So long and fat. Perfect. All right, so we are doing a turkey botch. 
<laughs> I don't think we can fit. Nope, just not gonna work. Yeah. I don't want them crowded. No. Nope. So I guess, well shoot, I was hoping to get some ducks in there too, but I guess we'll do that next batch. Yep. Okay. So, you put the lid on. Like so. Okay. And pause it a minute. All right, now it says uh, for turkey eggs, we need to uh, set the humidity to about uh, 60 degrees. So, set. <laughs> 60, and it tells us what the humidity is. And over here it's telling us what the temperature is and it's slowly bringing that up. Now, what's the temperature for the turkeys supposed to be? 99.5. All right, so how do you tell if it's set for that? Um, you hit, you do the set, okay, and it then. tells you what each one is. And now I can change the temperature like that. Okay. Same with the humidity. Okay. And to change it from temperature uh, from Fahrenheit to Celsius, mm -hmm. hold that down and hit it's set. set. And here in America, we like our Fahrenheit. Mm -hmm. All right, so we have a total of two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. So we got a dozen turkey eggs. So would this be considered day one? Yeah, this is day one. Now we'll wait um, in about a week. We'll candle them, and these goes. These guys will go for. Hold on a second. I think it's twenty-eight days. Yeah, I believe for turkeys it's twenty-eight. Is your Google smarty pants? Yes. <laughs> and look, the cat is already in the box. Foxy, what are you doing, Foxy? This is where I get my incubator.org. Incubator, .org. incubator yeah, it's not coming up, honey. Oh, okay. I can put it in the link, in, uh, in the, at the link in the descriptions. And... Yeah, I believe it's 28 days on these guys. Okay. All right, so we'll get back with you. Um, if we catch the, um, the table turning, we'll show that, but, uh, yes. here, here we Turkey go. Turkey eggs hatch in 28 days. Mm -hmm. So at, uh, oh, we forgot to do the, uh, turning. We can set how often we want it to turn. I believe with factory settings, it, uh, now we want this these eggs to turn every five to seven hours so what we're going to do is hold the set five to seven hours yeah every oh, five to seven okay. hours so we want it to go whoops so we're going to do it every three hours this incubator do every hour every two hours or every three hours three hours so we're or going to do it or off and at day 26, we'll turn it off. So there'll be no turning. And we are going to do a test turn, which we can see this egg right here. You see that little splotch on it right there. We can use that other thing. I'll hold this down for five seconds. see any turning. Neither did I. Maybe you got a hold in? Mm. 
There they go. There they go. That's because it was already to one side. Beautiful. That's pretty cool. Alrighty. So I'm excited about this. All right, well, this is the end of day one, putting the eggs in the incubator. We'll get back with you in a week whenever we candle the eggs. Boxy, what are you doing? Out of box. Out of the box. Out of box. Silly girl. She's playing. This you cannot play with. This is a no-no. Because you take this and you drag it all over the house.